I'm Kay, and I'm a late bloomer. Let's talk about sunflowers. They're beautiful, they grow fast, everyone loves them. There's just a few things you need to watch out for. I planted my first sunflower seeds right along the street in my parkway, February 1st. By February 28th, when I was harvesting my first cauliflower, they were 10 inches tall. You can see them in the background of this shot. My first casualty, I thought, was on March 18th on garbage pickup day when the trash lid decapitated one of my plants. Sophia and neighbor Michael dropped by to offer their condolences. See how big it is? It didn't break. No. They were three feet tall when the wind and rains of March caught me by surprise and almost blew them down. It was all I could do to secure them. They were growing so fast. It was still blowing April the 8th when I attempted to shoot this video. <laughs> My voice was nearly drowned out by the wind. My first sunflower. Now, these trunks are very thick, but they need a lot of support. When you plant from seeds, put a big metal stake in the ground that's as tall as your sunflower is going to be, because when the wind comes, they're going to need the support. All these leaves have problems. See the little bumpy texture? Something's been eating the leaves. But the only evidence I've ever found was this. It's kind of like a miniature pretzel. The middle of April, when the sunflowers were in full bloom, CL and I were sitting out in the driveway when we had a couple of surprise guests. I just happened to have my camera handy. Goldfinches weren't the only ones attracted. You can see what attracted them to my place. By the middle of May, I had some breathtaking blooms. <laughs> One plant alone had 26. This was the funkiest bloom I had. Not sure what happened here. <laughs> Meanwhile, I had already gotten another few sunflowers started. They grow so fast. Six weeks later, it looks like this. And the blooms are almost ready to pop. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. With all these blooms at the top, they get really top heavy, so that's where you need to secure them. Follow the directions on the seed packet and put the stake in the ground when you plant the seeds. <laughs> Last week, I decided to read up on sunflower care. I hadn't bothered to do that when I started. And I learned that when the blooms droop over and the petals start falling off, you better get a paper bag around the blooms quick or the seeds are gonna be all over the ground. The next day I went out and it looked like this. Oops. These are Lemon Queen. And I'm planting more sunflowers, different varieties. <laughs> New neighbor Mona was walking by with her dogs. I've been wanting to thank you for having such a great yard because every time I pass here in the morning, I smile. And, you know, to sunflowers me... Sunflowers make you smile. Sunflower, sunflowers <laughs> are the happiest flowers on the face of the earth. I'm Kay. I'm a late bloomer. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Even when it's not sunny, sunflowers brighten your day. God, that's corny. Even when it's not sunny. <laughs> Plant some sunflowers. What did you think of the sunflowers? Pretty tasty.